G'day, Michael Hayden here from Pacific Toyota. Mate, just here to run over this Toyota Hilux Dual Cab 4x2. Mate, before I do so, a bit about us. So Pacific Toyota, we run two large pre-owned vehicle yards up here in Cairns. This one being my main location at 251 Mulgrave Road. Um, mate, we do have our lovely sold section over there. Across the road, we do have our service centre as well, parts department, Lexus and Cairns showroom and new vehicle showroom as well. Mate, as far as used cars go, or pre-owned vehicles, we stock anywhere between sort of that 150 to 225 cars. Um, at the moment, I think we're sitting about 210. Um, and look, we sell in the vicinity of sort of that 175 to 200 a month. And mate, to be honest, we send up to 80% of them um, between here and Brizzy's. So, mate, just want to go to the car in complete detail. Um, so I'm just going to start by coming around the front bumper. If there's any concerns that you're not happy with on the car, let me know. Mate, I'll see what solutions I can come up with um, in getting them rectified. So, mate, just coming around that front bumper, there was a couple little scrapes on here, but nothing too major just down there. As I come up, once again, another little mark just there on the base of the bumper below the grill. Just continuing around through there as well. Just showing you the front grill there. As you can see, there's a little bit of, um, I suppose you could call, I'm not sure whether you want to use it called perforation, but um, it's just slightly not got a shine there from its mat area. Um, but that's just that through there. Pretty standard, to be honest. Sun usually gets to that. Um, but just continuing around, once again, a couple little marks there on the plastic, but nothing too major. As for the bonnet side of things, just coming around, as you can see, all very well looked after. Um, all around just great looking car. Um, it's very good and very clean for a workhorse. Um, usually we see them in a lot worse condition, but to see something as tidy as this is rare. I'm um, just continuing down to the base there. Mate, as for tread itself, plenty of tread on it, so you're not going to be up for a set of tyres anytime soon. Um, as for the rim itself, there's no dents or scrapes on it, so it's all up to speed. I'll just try and get in so I can show you how clean the suspension system is. Mate, the car looks like it's definitely done city driving all its life. Um, it's been very well looked after. Um, just continuing down the bodywork of the vehicle. Once again, all very nice and well looked after. Um, there's a little bit of a mark, but that's just come off there. Uh, I don't know what it's from. Um, just down through there. This is the base of the sills. Um, it's got the weather shields on it as well, which is always handy, especially up in far north Queensland. We definitely love rain up here. Um, just coming across and down through there. Uh, I'm just going to jump into the car itself. Oh, I've locked it by accident. I've got a keys here. There we go. Um, so inside, just going over the door card as well. Once again, all very well looked after through there. I'm not sure that's a mark. Um, yeah, it is. That will come off through there through detail by looks of things. I'm not 100% sure. I'll just try. Yeah, it's coming off with my finger there, so that's just part of it, getting a wipe over. Um, got the rubber floor mats and the vinyl flooring in it as well. Um, as for the seats, there's a couple little sort of white marks through there. More than happy to try and get that um, washed for you. Um, we have a, uh, what do you call it? I suppose a fabric cleaner uh, machine. Um, wet vac, I think you can call it. Um, and we can give that a clean if that's a, of concern to you. You know, if it's not, then no biggie. Um, through the dash there down to the center console once again all very well looked after now i do have the service book here so i'm just going to get to the page that we need to get to so its first service was done at 5500 at skyfleet toyota then again at skyfleet at 15 again at 22 again at 31 again at 46 uh, with skyfleet uh, again at 69 uh, again at 81 They've got two in there for that, then 84. So um, you've got the four logbook service history in there. Uh, we'll just check there's no more notes at the back of the book because um, there's a sort of substitute area here for servicing manual. Um, nah, that's all good. So everything's all in the front of the book. Um, just want to go over that there. Mate, as for keys in the vehicle as well, while I'm here, you do have your two central locking keys. Um, and then you've got two wet keys or three keys there for the Toyota itself. And then you've got your canopy keys. So. You've got all that through there. Um, I'm just going to continue into the back here as well. Um, once again, it's going through the door cards. All very well looked after um, through there. Final flooring throughout the back. There's no rubber mats in the back, just in the front. 
Um, we've got the rear seat through here. Once again, there's a couple of little minor marks through here or a little bit of a tear. Mate, if, like I said, if it's concerned, let me know. Um, you can always speak to management and getting that um, glued and sorted back out. Um, but if you're gonna chuck seat covers on it, then obviously it's not that, um, not that big a worry. Um, just gonna sort of do a wide angle for the canopy here um, through there. Okay. Then you continue through to your, you've got the tow bar at the back, um, as well as your obviously rear tires. Once again, plenty of tread, no uh, dents on them at all. So that's good. Um, to get into the, the back here, I'm just gonna do the side here. Back again. Sorry, it's gonna need two hands here for a second. Okay. Um, I can open this up then, like so. Okay, so then you got all through in here. They're not cheap, these alloy canopies. Um, tell you what, it's very shiny in here. I um, don't know if they're always like that, but um, very clean and tidy in here, which is good. Um, very practical on the roof. They've got some nice reinforcements there, so I'm not sure um, I'm going to take that design because of the, um, yeah, to hold a few things on there, I guess. I'm not sure. Um, so that's all that through there. have got a rear door as well um, on it, um, as well as the sides. And you've got the glass window, so if you're not got it all the way up the top and, and stuff, you've got that rear vision still. Um, down here, you do have your um, tow bar with the seven pin flat plug. As well as that, you've got a reversing camera fitted to it. So you've got all that through there. Mate, just continue my way around. Um, so as you can see, all very well looked after. Plenty of tread on that rear tire there. Just gonna continue down the bodywork on this. Looks like there's a very fine little dent here. Um, very minor. Look on the roof there. I'm just going to continue down to the very front and then I'll jump in the, um, the driver's side. Have the paintwork all through there to the front. Okay. All right, just going to jump on in, show you the driver's side. Um, so, obviously, this is the main traffic area. So, mate, you've got a few uh, little scratches through here, looks usually from fingernails or keys. Um, so, you got all that in there. Um, but all in all, very well looked after. Um, just coming through again, through there. A um, little bit of wear through here, so you do have that on the seat. Like I said, um, if that's a concern, let me know. I'll have a chat to management. Um, or if you want, we can you know, look at getting some seat covers. Um, unless you already have that planned, then no worries at all. Um, it does have a brake controller fitted to it, so you can tow anything with electric brakes as well, which is handy. Um, so you've got that as an accessory. I'm just going to turn the car on. Um, so turbo diesel. Um, we've got 86949 on the clock. Um, next service is due at uh, 94,000 k's, which is handy. Um, so manual. Just get that to focus. You do get two modes, power mode and eco mode as well, so you can get a little bit of extra acceleration. Reverse camera through there. Mate, that sort of sums up the vehicle. So, as you can see, um, obviously the car has been used, what it's designed for, a bit of a workhorse. If you have any concerns, let me know. But, mate, all around great car, um, well equipped, um, very well set up. But, mate, any questions, give us a call on 0410 839 933. Thanks for your time.